How you doing guys? Please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. This is the HTML email developer channel. And again, I'm here to answer all your questions and concerns about becoming an HTML email developer. Now we have a question about Salesforce. This question was, um, should I learn Salesforce become, before becoming an e HTML email developer? Ah, uh, that's kind of a um, hard question. It's like a yes and no. Okay, let me explain. Um, you don't have to learn Salesforce to uh, get a lot of HTML email developer positions. In your best interest, you should learn it before you even go out looking for, uh, I mean, go, on, go out on interviews. You should learn Salesforce. I'm just going to be honest. Uh, had, I, had I known about Salesforce before uh, starting HTML email development, I would have learned Salesforce first. Uh, it would have helped me answer a lot of automation questions per se, but also, uh, man, that's big to have Salesforce on your on your resume, to be honest. Um, I don't know if uh, I did a, a search on uh, Indeed Salesforce, thousands of jobs came up. I mean, in the thousands. Uh, I can't, maybe 11 some thousand, it was up there. Thousands of jobs. And the reason I said you should learn it first because I think it uh, it would uh, separate you from a lot of people that you know has, hasn't learned that. Again, it's a lot of jobs that don't use Salesforce marketing. But in my experiences, I'd say out of all the interviews I went on, maybe 65% of the time they were asking me that I know Salesforce. I hear it all the time. Even when recruiters call me uh, after, you know, uh, checking out my resume, they call me, they always ask me, do you have Salesforce uh, uh, marketing cloud experiences? And um, even if they don't ask me, sometimes I tell them um, I'm also learning Salesforce marketing cloud. And they say, oh, that's a plus. Oh, great, great. So the answer is, no, you don't have to learn it. I mean, you don't, you don't. Um, because there's, you know, Marketo, Pardot, um, I'm missing some other ones, but it's some other uh, marketing cloud uh, automation software out there that uh, people use uh, and they don't have no interest in you trying to use Salesforce. And um, But if you learn Salesforce first, trust me, your, your uh, I'd say, uh, your options to go on interviews and, and land jobs is going to be more plentiful than if you didn't know Salesforce. Trust me. I can't tell you every time I went on an interview, at one point it was like, do you know Salesforce? Do you know Salesforce? Do you know Salesforce? I'm like, wow, wow. And a lot of times I didn't get the job because I didn't know Salesforce. So again, it'll make you more of a valuable asset as an employer, future employee, if you learn Salesforce. But you don't have to learn Salesforce. Um, my job that I got now, they don't even use Salesforce. So, and a lot of companies don't. But a lot of them do. Um, so the, um, another question is, do you have to have a Salesforce certification uh, to become an HTML email developer? I think it's called a Salesforce Marketing Cloud uh, certification. Uh, you, you don't. You don't have to have that. Um, I also had a lot of people call me and said, hey, you don't have to have a certification. You just have to know your way around uh, Salesforce. And if you could go in the interview and present yourself well and answer the questions uh, pertaining to uh, Salesforce, then you still can get the job and you still could, uh, you know, you can still could start learning Salesforce on the job as well. So no, no certification is needed. I mean, Salesforce is uh, so much in high demand that people are like, people are like, you don't have to have the certification, you just know what you're doing, you just know the language and uh, know how to navigate around Salesforce and that will be fine. But if you have that certification, a lot of people will be knocking on your door, trust me. But a lot of people will not be knocking on your door anyway. Um, it was one time I had Salesforce on my resume and it was overwhelming because people just, man, it was calling me, a lot of recruiters just calling me, calling me, calling me. And I had to take it off because I said, I don't think I'm ready 
uh, because they're in high demand and the things they were asking me, I just didn't think I was ready uh, to use Salesforce because I didn't know. I didn't know it that well as I thought I did. So I took it off my resume because people are constantly calling me, recruiters constantly calling me. So that is a big staple to put on your resume. Uh, now you can do what I did, I'm gonna give you a pro tip. You can do what I did, I did. I'm still doing. I just put, uh, on my LinkedIn, I just put Salesforce um, uh, training, uh, Salesforce, for, Salesforce in training or something like that. Letting them know I'm still trying to learn Salesforce. And um, you know, you get a lot of calls from that as well. But at least they know you're in training and that you're trying to learn uh, Salesforce. Again, guys, the answer is you can get a job without Salesforce, but if you knew Salesforce, man, it's going to make open up so many doors for you. And, uh, yeah, man, you won't be in the position I was. You know, I was getting turned down because I didn't know Salesforce. Didn't get a second call back because I didn't know Salesforce. But I know it now. Uh, I don't know it as much as I would like to, uh, but I'm still learning. And uh, like I said, it's just knowing how to navigate around the marketing cloud and the journey builders and things of that nature so again this channel was here to help you guys with any comments or questions that you have to help uh you know you have a better uh, path of getting an html developer than i did it took me nine to twelve months i'm going to say nine months but it was three months i wasn't serious the last nine months i was and it still took me a while but i thank god we're here I didn't give up on uh, I can't tell you how many interviews. If I go through my Yahoo email, it, it will be kind of scary how many interviews I went on. But don't give up, persevere, and just keep going. It'll happen for you. So please, guys, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Take care.